so I think that's another big thing. So how long the season that cut down. Yeah, with with the with the defense, especially with the pressuring and the traffic, what what do you think was really successful today that maybe you guys have been able to improve and evolve with? As far as defensively? Yeah, just in terms of maybe, you know, you guys were doing the same type of trap and pressing before, but today it seemed to really be really rattled them and really be effective. Um I think it started just with our intensity of the trap. It wasn't kind of just a soft, maybe go, let them get through, then back off. We actually really went. And then when they got the ball into the big, um, we were letting the guards get it back. And I think that kind of just took them out the flow of their offense. Then from there, they started playing a game that uh, they didn't really want to play. We started going one on one a little bit. So I think that was what went into our hands. Were you, were you trying to get to 35? 35? No, nah, I should have made my free throws, though. That's what I was kind of mad about. Hey, how is this 6-2 start different from last year's 8-0 start? Um, man, to be honest, I, don't, I think it's different because we're not really worried about our record. I think this is the first time since I've been here we're not worried about just records and, and playing. We're just worried about the next game coming up. And if we're doing what we're supposed to do, the outcome will come. Not going to turn in our favor. And if we're doing what we're supposed to do and we come up with a loss, then chuck it up to the better teams. But... I think as we focus on doing what we need to do, getting in the lanes, um, running our offensive fluidly, then the score will be in our favor. How's your attitude different in this team than the other team? You've been here a long time. So this, this team is not different. I know you have a lot of young guys. But. Yeah, I always tell people I think they don't know better. Like, they don't know not to have a bad attitude. They're still, like, they're all excited to be in college. I mean, think about this. What, what is this, our eighth game? They're still in the moment. Like, man, this is college basketball. Now, as we keep having success, that's only going to get bigger for them. So I think it's just fun to be around the environment. It's always kind of just goofy, always laughing, joking around almost too much. But it just keeps the environment in a good place. A few more guys. How do you keep from having a letdown, you know, going to Montana, who, you know, almost beat Gonzaga tonight? Always having a sense of urgency. We know that we're not perfect, so we know every, every game is going to be tough. Um, I think we strive for perfection, even though we know it's going to be impossible to reach. And I think that's the biggest thing about this team. So it'll start uh, on Thursday when we have practice. Coach Conroy's birthday today. Yeah. Do you guys do anything special? We won the game. <laughs> I think that's all he wants. Thanks, Andrew.